All right, listen up. You've all been summoned to space to partake in void combat against the... Hold on, why is Donald commanding the biggest ship in the fleet? He literally refused to play unless he could bring the biggest vessel in his chapter to the fight. The weaponized Trump Tower is the biggest ship the Imperium has ever seen. Even though this is battle group Obama, it's fair to say I'm in charge. Absolutely not. Any further objections will result in the Trump Tower shoving its ram so far up your ship's stern, the machine spirit will visibly blush. Fucking fine, Jesus. You ready to go, Commissar Joe? This is actual cruel and unusual punishment. Why do I have to serve the stupid Im Imperium this time around? This is a 1v1 Sleepy Joe. And since the majority of us are part of the Imperium, we went out on which faction we're all going to be. Plus, I'd honestly rather have normal diplomatic meetings with other countries without flexing my Diet Coke button than play as the towel. All right, well, I expect at least half the ships to have either mutinied or outright been scuttled by the end of this fight. Despite facing what's been reported as a numerically inferior foe, Donnie doesn't have the best track record for space combat. Regardless, I'm commanding the Retribution battleship. So, Donnie, I expect you to order my vessel to close range so I can make use of my ram. Of course Bush chooses the vessel that can do a lot of damage by flying into shit. You want us to plant explosives at the weak parts of enemy ships before you fly into them, too? And we're off. I must admit I've seen more competent naval formations with Somali pirates, but I suppose we can work with this. Putting the long-range Nova cannons behind the rest of the fleet is a somewhat smart move. At least I'm not aiming the long-range artillery at hospitals or any other quote-unquote terrorist sites. All right, everyone, get the ships into position and remember to try and stay at a long range. We're facing off against Hive Fleet Nikocado. The bio ships under his command are especially hungry. Heads up, we've got a swarm of Tyranid fighters closing in on our position. Donald ordered the launch of interceptors to counter them. No, I don't really feel like it. The fuck do you mean you don't feel like it? Those Tyranid fighters are going to wreak havoc on our support ships. Shh, easy now, Bushy. Calm yourself before you declare exterminatus on Iraq again out of instinct. The flak fields our battleships provide will be more than enough to deal with the fighters. Scanners have revealed numerous Tyranid bioships closing in. Main batteries and lances fire. Try to find their command ship. Donald, tell the Mars cruisers to fire their Nova cannons in a synchronized volley. Remember, they take time to detonate, so be sure to deploy A. Too late already fired them. Dead center of that formation. You fucking what? Donald, you election denying, 87 BMI looking more felonies than Horace having dumb ass. The Tyranid ships are just gonna fly right past the Nova cannons. You just wasted one third of our artillery volleys. Watch as I turn three Nova cruisers and a gothic ship into a mukbang video. That bio Titan ship is beelining right for our backline artillery. It's already closed the gap. Not to mention our largest ship is getting harassed by their line vessels. Donnie, do something. Shit, shit, shit. Uh, everyone fire, I guess. Make the cannons go boom. Why is that bio titan not a floating hunk of dead meat yet? Donald, explain yourself. Crooked Hillary sabotaged the ship's cannons and interfered with the election, I mean targeting computers. Bio titan has been destroyed. And it looks like Donnie is finally using a stasis bomb before wasting the Nova cannon barrage. His IQ has surpassed that of the average world eater. Just for that, I'm not using the Nova cannons out of pure spite. I'll pull the Trump flagship, the biggest flagship that ever flagshiped around to save your inferior Imperial Navy vessels, Obama. Commissar Biden, morale is dropping rapidly on multiple vessels. Give the menial crew a threatening speech to keep them in line. You all uh, b be better stop all of that uh, malarkey or else uh, no chocolate chocolate ice cream. I think that speech only made them angrier and less motivated to fight. Nice one, Joey. Good shit, everyone. With the death of their command ship, most of the remaining Tyranid vessels have lost cohesion. Pick them off like how I picked off swing states in 2016. Only a few more bio ships to take down. Punch through so we can initiate stage two of cleansing the galaxy of Hive Fleet Nikocado. All thanks to me and my perfect coordination of the fleet. You can all thank me later. Uh, fuck it, fine. You did learn some things, Donnie, but ultimately you caused the destruction of many of Obama's support ships. Fair trade, Bush. And remember, I'm the smartest one when it comes to trades. Anyway, let's go planet side to commence the land invasion.